Hello, everybody. My name is Gilad Barnell from Good Dollar, and I'm excited to see you all here. So, Good Dollar is a non-profit foundation with a mission to build a new global open source currency based on the principles of Universal Basic Income, or UBI, and I'm happy to welcome you to Hack and Equality, the hackathon for reducing wealth inequality through blockchain, in which we'll explore and develop solutions to promote this cause. Okay, let's start. So we are here with Ron Adam, an Israeli ambassador in Rwanda and former deputy ambassador in the UN. So Ron, you've talked to our teams uh, in the hackathon for reducing inequality. Mm -hmm. uh, what was your impression of the team's work? Well, I thought uh, uh, they, they did a wonderful job. They uh, thought about new ideas, how to uh, balance uh, between the rich and the poor. Uh, and it's, it's a good cause, it's important. Um, it's always a challenge to finance development and it's also part of the world effort uh, for development generally. I think you guys had uh, an open mind of so many uh, application use cases only from 16 hours, so well done, really. Woo we raise money from the private sector, allocate it towards the public sector to intervene with pre-diabetics and generate returns based on the improvements in those pre-diabetics health behaviors. Hello everyone, good morning. Uh, so we at uh, Team Lightning have decided to uh, tackle uh, a problem that everybody has and try to solve it also with uh, some good faith and, uh, and contribution to society. Uh, who here uh, snoozes their alarm in the morning? big problem in the world today is the lack of trust between donors like all of you and the end beneficiary the people uh, and the causes that need to be improved in order to make the whole uh, world a better place and a safer place for all of us. And that's the note here, as long as there is this trust is universal, if other trust authorities will decide this is not a high school, this is a malicious entity giving trust for his own controlled user. The real problem uh, diabetes, especially with kids, and I can envision uh, health stations. I'm, I'm involved in a pro bono uh, work uh, with a certain foundation that have health checkups in schools. So this is definitely the infrastructure is there, but you need the incentive model. And I think that you really tick the boxes of all the participants of the ecosystem, and they have a very strong incentive to get this on the road. And obviously, that's a good place to start. Yeah. Ooh, good job.